Welcome to HKUST. In order to help you adapt to staying in the off-campus apartments, the Student Housing Office has prepared the following video to familiarize you with some important information you must know throughout your stay at off-campus apartments in the coming residential year. After watching this video, you should be able to know the ways to commute between the apartment and the campus. To operate electrical appliances provided in the apartment, to request for maintenance service when required, to ensure your personal safety and security, and to handle emergencies whenever necessary. We hope that you may be able to get the best out of your study and stay in HKUST. The university provides off-campus accommodation at three locations. Namely, Taipo Tai Village, Sam Long Village, and Hong Kong Adventist College. Sam Long Village Apartment. Approximately ten minutes by bus from UST campus to Tang Lan Shu. Take KMB bus number ninety one or ninety one M from UST bus station. Board the bus going towards Diamond Hill MTR Station. Get off at Tianlan Shu Stop for about five minutes. Walk backwards from the bus stop, and you will arrive at the main entrance at Samlong Village. After entering the entrance, follow the path and signs as shown. Usage of electronic devices and equipment. Air conditioner. Press the power button once to turn on the air conditioner. Press the control button to adjust temperature. And select the mode that you prefer. Press the power button once to turn off the air conditioner. Press the power button once to turn on the air conditioner. Dial the switches to adjust temperature and select the mode. Press the power button once to turn off the air conditioner. Procedures for cleaning the air conditioner filter. Turn off the air conditioner. Open the cover of the air conditioner and pull out the filter. Wash the filter with fresh water. Place the filter at a good ventilation place and let it dry. Place the filter back to the air conditioner when it is completely dry. Turn off the air conditioner. Open the cover of the air conditioner and pull out the filter. Wash the filter with fresh water. Place the filter at a good ventilation place and let it dry. Place the filter back to the air conditioner when it is completely dry. Induction cooker. Press the power button to turn on the induction cooker. And enter the hot pot mode. Press the function button to select relative function. Press the temperature control button to adjust the level of heat temperature. Press the power button to turn off the induction cooker after cooking. Range hood. Press the power button to turn on the range hood. Press the light button to turn on the light of range hood. Press the button to turn on left right fan. 
Turn off the fan. Lights and power after use. Water heater. Turn on the water heater by pushing the power switch on the wall. Adjust the level of heat. Turn off after use. Washing machine. Put the clothes into the washing machine and close the door. Pull to open the detergent container of the washing machine. Put in an appropriate amount of detergent and close the container. Set the washing mode and temperature. Press the power button to start operation. When washing is finished, the washing machine will stop automatically. Release the power button and wait for two to three minutes. Open the door and take out the clothes. Whenever you find any electronic devices is or out of order, you should turn off the device and power first. Check the fuse box in the apartment to see if the fuse has jumped. Fuse box is located on the wall behind the kitchen door. Reset the fuse button to restore power supply. In case the problem persists after resetting the fuse, power off the device and email to student housing office shoinfo@ust.hk to report the defect. Security and safety. Whenever you leave your room and or apartment, close the windows and switch off the lights and air conditioner. Close and lock the room door. Check and turn off the cooking devices and water heater. Close and lock the apartment door. Close the building gate. Safety devices. Fire extinguisher and fire blankets are provided in each apartment inside the kitchen and cupboard. Repair and maintenance. Send email to shoinfo@ust.hk to report any defects of furniture, fittings, and appliances found within your apartment. The SHO will arrange repair and maintenance as soon as defect report is received. Residents should note that it takes time to arrange for maintenance service. Emergency contacts. Please dial nine 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 and inform the student housing office and security control center. Two three five eight eight nine nine nine. This office is open twenty four hours a day. Non emergency contacts. Residents can contact the following offices: the student housing office, two three five eight eight five eight three. This office is open Monday to Friday, but not on public holidays. It is open from eight forty five to one p.m. and then from two p.m. to five thirty p.m. Off-campus housing section. This office is open Monday to Friday, but not on public holidays. It is open from eight forty-five a.m. to one p.m. and then from two p.m. to five thirty p.m. Hygiene. Nonetheless, residents are reminded that. Tidiness and cleanliness of the common areas is a joint responsibility of all the residents living in the same flat. Please be considerate and cooperative. A cleaning job duty roster would be worked out with fellow flatmates 
to keep the premises clean and tidy. In the coming residential year, SHO will arrange a monthly cleaning service to clean the public areas of the apartment. Feel free to contact the Student Housing Office at 2358-8583 or the off-campus housing section at 2719-4825 during office hours or email to shoinfo at ust.hk for any inquiry and report about off-campus housing.